So tonight we've got a little bit of football on tap. Uh, what do we have? We have some 2013 Panini Black. We have 2017 Pantheon football. That just came out today, so I'm excited to get into that. And what else? Some 2011 Prime Signatures. And we do break in the order that things ended on eBay, so it will actually be Black followed by Prime Signatures followed by Pantheon. But first up, let's take a look at our nightly random winners up to this point in time. So we pull one person out per night, of course, and um, that person that comes out each night advances into Lucky U3, which is our July customer appreciation break. That break will be on Saturday, August the 5th at 6 o'clock. And here's everybody who's in so far. Now the key is we got to grab somebody to put in tonight, right now. So let me get let me get to the right page here. So it doesn't cost anything to uh, to be in the Lucky U3 break. I pay for everything, and the hits go out to you guys. But the only way to get in here is by way of the nightly random. So let's see who. Random.org wants to be nice to tonight. And I do leave everything in there, even the stuff that says like unpaid and no bids and all that, just because, you know, it's better to kind of be able to see what's going on. All right, so this comes up with uh, Jake RE797 8, who I believe also won the other night. But that is okay, you can win it more whoops you can win it more than once let's try that one more time well it's right there so we'll just copy it from this other one you can win more than once uh, it'll just give you an extra chance uh, in that nightly random or in that monthly random when we do the customer appreciation break because obviously you know we don't always have as many hits as we have people so just increases your odds there so congrats on on that win again tonight. Give me one second here to get our new spreadsheet set up and we'll take a look at who is in break number one, which is our uh, Panini Black Football. So you will see here, this is one box 2013 Panini Black. This is the 10th time we've bro broken it. Of course, our end date, uh, that is tonight. And the time is right here and now. Anything that says unpaid on there, um, you know, the team was sold, but payment had not come in as of maybe five minutes ago. If it has come in in the interim, or as long as it does come in, you will get whatever cards you pull. It's only if you leave me holding the bag that, of course, you will, won't get whatever cards uh, would be pulled. <laughs> And anything that says no bids buyback, I know there were a couple of those on there. Um, so anything that says no bids buyback is just pretty self-explanatory. Just an, an orphan team. Nobody wanted it. So if anything comes out for that team, it'll hang out here with me. We're going to do one more little thing here and take this camera off of autofocus and change it up just a little so that it will be easier to see our cards. I know it throws the background out of focus a little, but it, it gives me the ability to see the cards up closer. We can see them with a little more detail. And also, you don't have to worry about that pesky zooming in and out, which it tends to want to do on autofocus and makes me crazy. Off the bottom, we will have our metal card. And this one is Matt Ryan. And of course you can see, you know, it's kind of uh, hard to see. And it's because it has a plastic uh, protective coating over it. And that's to keep it from getting all beat up in the pack, I suppose. So first out is uh, Metal Captain's Matt Ryan headed to the Falcons. And let's go ahead and just pull our base cards around from the bottom so that all we have left are the hits. We always want to save the best for last, right? Patrick Peterson to 25 for the Cardinals. And all the cards uh, in black are going to be numbered. And most of them will also have some little minor edge wear and chipping and things, which is uh, pretty common on most of these thicker cards. This is a 399 Luke Wilson for the Seahawks. 
Falcons, Robert Alford to 399. Percy Harvin to 399 for the Seahawks. Vincent Jackson for the Bucks. Oh, I didn't pay attention. Also to 399. I forgot to look and see what he was numbered to. I was already looking ahead. Shame on me. And this one also to 399 on the Tyler Bray for the Chiefs. Our first hit is Mr. Kenny Stills to 299 for the Saints. And that, of course, is a little, little swatch of material there on Kenny. And that's going to be followed up by another saint, but this one's Kenny Vaccaro. And that is numbered to 97 of 90 on the Kenny Vaccaro. Got a little bitty tiny signature. Got all that space on that sticker and that little bitty tiny signature. And next out to 199 for the Bills, we have Jeff. Tool is that pronounced Tool something probably similar to that. I actually am not familiar with him. Oh, love it. Love, love, love. Okay, first of all, this design is like one of my favorites, if not my favorite card in 2013 black. This little shadow box jersey kind of card. Love it. And, of course, the signature is there on card uh, on top of the plastic or whatever. This obviously is Aaron Dobson for the Patriots. Uh, you do have a little bit of uh, chipping and things, particularly down there in that lower right corner that you can notice, but... That is numbered to 99, and again, a little chipping on the back as well, but man, what a cool card. Cool, cool. I absolutely love those little shadow box jerseys, so yay. Congratulations, Patriots, on that hit. And then we're going to wrap it up with some Vance McDonald to 299 for the 49ers. So... We will recap here real quickly what we pulled out of 13 black. May as well start with the one in my hand, Vance McDonald. That is on card and, of course, a nice two-color patch to $2.99. Then we had the Aaron Dobson for the Pats. Jeff, I think we're going to pronounce, well, I'm going to pronounce that tool <laughs> for the Bills. Kenny Vaccaro for the Saints. Kenny Stills for the Saints. And then the little uh, Matt Ryan metal captains with uh, the little plastic protective coating on there. So that is 2013 Panini Black Football. I'm going to go ahead and set that off to the side on the breaking or the sorting mat, rather, rather than the breaking mat. Next up will be some 2011 Prime Signatures. So let me pull up the spreadsheet, and we're going to take a look at that. It's a half case, so if anybody is in chat and you feel uh, inclined to say whether or not you want the right half of the case or the left half of the case or whatever, jump in and let me know. Otherwise, uh, I'll just kind of pick some. So this will be five boxes, 2011 Prime Signatures. That is a half case, and this will be break number 25 of 2011 Prime. Same format as before, teams on one side, your name and lights across from it as the winning bidder. Anything that says unpaid, once again, if you jumped in late, uh, as long as you take care of payment, I'm going to take care of getting your cards to you. So, no worries there. And nobody, nobody's going to say anything in chat, whether you want the right half or the left half. No one wants to take on the responsibility of... Uh, of choosing the lucky part of the box. No? I know there's a tiny little bit of a delay in chat, so I'll give it another second or two here to see if anybody jumps in. And if not, then I guess... Oops, gosh, I just knocked my whole uh, iPad over. <laughs> That's what I use for my, so that I can see chat is uh, the iPad and oh boy, now I really did a hot mess. I knocked it over and then I turned off my, oh, I turned off my live feed. <laughs> so there we go. Well, while I was sorting through that, meanwhile, Wayne popped in and said left side of the box. So thank you, Wayne. <laughs> while I was busy fighting with my uh, iPad because I have a clumsy thumb there and knocked myself into 
a whole other video, which was not very smart. So here are our five boxes of 2011 Prime. Of course, this is going to be, I'm just moving that a little bit. It's kind of in a weird spot. So there's one pack in each of these boxes, and there will be one hit in each of these packs. Although once we did pull two hits out of the pack, I don't think it was supposed to be in there because I've never pulled any kind of hot boxes out of there before, but nonetheless, one time we did get lucky, so let's hope we do again tonight in that regard. We may pull some redemptions in here that will, will be expired if we pull them, but that doesn't mean you won't still get the card. So if you do pull an expired redemption, you do want to go ahead and redeem it into your Panini account, just like you would a non-expired redemption. And if they have the card, they'll ship it off to you. And if you haven't gotten a card or seen anything happen with it in six weeks or so, then jump on to Twitter and uh, reach out to at Panini CSM. That's the guy's handle, at Panini CSM. And ask him to help you out with it. Because sometimes, you know, they have to substitute and give you a different card or a different player or whatever. But they're really good about working with you in those kinds of instances. So if you end up in that situation, that's what you should do. But a lot of them I found they still have and they'll just drop them in the mail to you. So first up is Eli Manning for the Giants. That's numbered to 499. Every uh, card in Prime Sigs, 2011 Prime Sigs, is numbered, even the base. Reggie Wayne to 499 for the Colts. Jonathan Stewart for the Panthers to 99. And oh, look at that. Little Eddie George coming out to 25. Sweet, 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 sweet little Eddie George. That is a, a sticker auto, of course. Um, but that is a great hit. Now, of course, you will see, well, at least I think it is, because I like veterans, okay? So I'm, I'm happy with the pull. But you guys will notice this, uh, this is a Houston Oilers card. So it goes to the Tennessee Titans. That is because the Houston Oilers became the Tennessee Oilers became the Tennessee Titans. Card always stays with its franchise. And all of that info is in every single uh, item description down there at the bottom in the little special circumstances area. Darrell Rivas to 499 for the Jets. Santana Moss to 499 for the Redskins. Mr. Jerry Rice to 25 for the Niners. Ooh, we're going to have a printing plate, which means we got a one of one and it's signed. And who is it? Who is that? Oh, it's a Viking. That is Kyle Rudolph. How about that? Nice little uh, Kyle Rudolph one of one signed printing plate for the Vikings. And I'm guessing uh, maybe Larson's Resort has them has the Vikings tonight. They usually do. So if you do have them tonight, and I'm guessing you probably do, congrats on that hit. And if you don't, whoever got it, obviously, congrats on it. But... But Larson's Resort plays the Vikings pretty faithfully, and uh, it's nice to nice to get rewarded with a hit. Mr. Franco Harris to 499 for my Pittsburgh Steelers. Matt Stafford to 499 Lions. Billy Houghton to 499 for the Pack, and a redemption. Which yeah, I predicted we were going to get one, so we'll look that up in a minute. We have to go to that uh, fun little checklist there, and then we'll also go online. We'll do both of those things. Eli Manning to 499 for the Giants. Charlie Trippy to 499 for the Cardinals. Barry Sanders to 499 for the Lions. Hey, there's a little Jake Locker to 199 for the Titans. So that is going to be our second hit headed to the Titans since they also uh, have the Oilers card. All right, next up, Joe Klecko to $4.99 for the Jets. Matt Ryan to $4.99 for the Falcons. Michael Vick to $99 for the Eagles. I forgot to pull. Oh, this is another one where we get two. Yay, happiness. <laughs> I 
a double hit pack. Yay, yay. All right, so we have Niles Paul to 199 for the Redskins, and then Jaquiz Rogers to 199 for the Falcons. So see, that's, you know, that's what I was talking about. We pulled one of these once before, so I guess maybe, you know, we just conjured it up by talking about it tonight. So we have an extra hit. You, put, you chose well, Wayne, with the left side of the box. You did well. The force was with you. Okay, so 187. There's a gnat flying around here. It just landed on this uh, checklist. I don't know if you saw it or not. I was going to smack it, but then I remembered I better not knock the camera off. Dequin, Dequan, Dequan Bowers is card number 187. So we're going to go to the Panini checklist here and uh, look this up. See where this is going to end up going. You guys know I always go to the checklist, no matter who it is or what it is or anything else. I always go to the website checklist, so just bear with me. And this was, what, Rookie Signatures Gold. So that ought to be a fairly low-numbered one. 187. Yeah, it's going to be numbered to 49, so that's nice. Um, and unusually low. These older products often were not numbered um, that low, as I'm sure you're familiar. They were very common for things to be uh, numbered much higher back in the day, so to speak. Okay, so... Card number 187, which is Daquan Bowers, is a Buccaneer, according to the uh, Panini website. And that will be numbered to 49. Our other hits, Jaquiz Rogers to 199 for the Falcons. Niles Paul to 199 for the Redskins. Jake Locker to 199 for the Titans. And our cool little one-of-one one printing plate autograph, uh, Kyle Rudolph, for the Vikings. I really just like that a lot. I always love pulling one-of-ones. Uh, I know some people don't like the printing plates, even though they are one-of-one, one, but I do. And then Mr. Eddie George, 225. And that, of course, uh, that Oilers, once again, goes to the Titans. So that wraps up 2011 Prime Signatures. But you know what that's going to bring us to. Oh, yeah. A little Pantheon. Of course, that's the full case. We're not opening the full case tonight. We're just doing this as a one, a one box. Because these are kind of expensive boxes. And, uh, you know, I want to make them last. So here we go. One box of 2017 Panini Pantheon football. First time we're going to break it because it just came out today. And we're going to roll down through here again and take a look. Now, I know that there's, uh, I, I think, I feel like, there must be some kind of a checkout thing going on tonight because some of these teams that are marked as unpaid, um, the bidder has paid for the rest of the stuff. And I did notice, you know, I had combined the invoice and then it had come uncombined and then I had tried to combine it again. And um, I think maybe there was an eBay checkout issue with some of that unpaid stuff, so... Once again, you know, no worries. As long as payment comes in, you're going to get your card. So, and if it is a, an eBay payment issue, I will help you get it sorted out as best I can. Or we'll find, find a way to work around it after the break. I don't actually access eBay or email or anything while we're doing the break. So, that's why it would be afterwards. Of course, eBay's stupid, messed up checkout that wasn't working is the reason, uh, supposedly, the reason the guy uh, didn't pay me the other night for 300 and some odd dollars. But I don't really know if that was the whole reason. I just took the top box here, right off the top of the case, and we're going to dig in. So there are seven cards in here, and I think most of them are hits. I think there's not, uh, does it say on here? Well, I think we may have one or two base in here, but there's a, a lot of hits in here as well. 
Yeah, I'm just, I, <laughs> usually the box will say, you know, you're going to have this and that and this and that, but this box doesn't really seem to want to tell us, does it? So there you go. This box is not being our friend. Oh, right off the top. Boy, we have a nice one right off the top. Yeah, we do. I'm sure you saw it already. Um, but I'm just looking to see where is our base. If we even have any base. Maybe we don't. Maybe this is all hits. So, boom. How about a little Dan Marino right off the top? Yeah, that's pretty sweet, isn't it? That's a sticker auto. Um coming out for the Dolphins numbered to 25 so there is number 24 of 25 Dan Marino for the Dolphins right off the top and I mean you know whatever you paid for the Dolphins you got a good deal <laughs> that's a nice hit Next up, for the Lions, we have Kenny Galladay signature and material. That is also a sticker auto, although it looks kind of like it's on card. Uh, it is actually a sticker. And that one is number 24 of 99. And everything in Pantheon is a low number. So this, I mean, this is a nice series of cards. Um, in my opinion, this is, this is a series that's going to be well worth its money. This is Josh Reynolds' rookie material and signature for the Rams, and that is numbered to 149. That's 37 of 149. Oh, nice little Joey Bossa there for the Chargers. I like that patch. You've got uh, four colors in there. Three colors in there. Why did I say four? I'm looking at the white on the card. Duh. No, let's try that again. <laughs> Three colors with the blue and the yellow, and the black. And Mr. Joey Bossa is number 2 of 25. Another nice hit. Big piece of material for Corey Davis for the Titans. That looks like, does it look like it's got a little dirt on it to you? That is maybe to me. Is this game used? And it just says player worn, 64 of 99. But I guess I'm just seeing things because it just seemed, it just looked like it had a little bit of dirt on it to me. <laughs> I don't know. Here's another nice big piece of material. Um, that is most likely part of the number. And then, of course, you've got the red next to it. And the Joe Williams is numbered to 49 for the 49ers. So that's always fun. And then our metal card. This is number 48 of 50, A.J. Green for the Bengals. This actually, you know, is already in plastic. It's in plastic inside the pack. So they're trying to keep that nice, obviously. So the little Mr. A.J. Green. Okay, so to recap, Bengals. 48 of 50 on the A.J. Green metal card. 49ers with the nice two-color patch, Joe Williams to 49. Titans, Corey Davis, another nice size patch, 64 of 99. Mr. Joey Bossa for the Chargers, number two of 25. Josh Reynolds for the Rams, that, of course, material and signature to 149. A little rookie hit there. Kenny Galladay for the Lions for our second rookie hit. And again, material and signature. That is 24 of 99. And then our big boom hit. Yeah, Dan Marino. Dan Marino. Love it. Uh, for the Dolphins, number 24 of 25. And if you have the Dolphins and you should happen to want a one-touch for your Dan Marino, um, shoot me a message over and let me know. Always happy to do that just at my cost or anybody else. If anybody ever wants a one touch for any of their stuff, you can send me that message and I'll take care of it for you. So this stuff, guys, look for it to ship out um, probably Saturday, possibly before, but probably Saturday. And of course, we got lots of other fun stuff uh, coming up this week, including Grand Reserve basketball that came out today and Allen and Genter baseball that came out today and 
all kinds of other interesting stuff. So as always, I thank you for your time and your participation and breaking with me, bidding with me, and I hope that I will see you again on another break. Take care and have a good night.